Welcome to the Artist Recreation World. I am with the Queen of Media, Madison J. Oh, <laughs> watch Hi. yourself, watch yourself. Hey. I don't know what's going to happen here. <laughs> Madison, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. It's been a long time coming for this, hasn't it? Right. Um, wow, we just worked on this. Like, we're going to get it done. We're going to get it done. But we're, a year we're here. later, here we are. <laughs> Madison and J Money was part of the reason I started the series Fizzle. way back in um, last year, I think in June. Um, both of you were encouraging me to just do it. If you had an idea, just put it out there. So about 110 interviews later, here we are. Oh, shout out to Jameson. J Money. J Fizzle, my new Peace, nizzle. peace, mm -hmm. peace, peace. Love life, Tupac. Thank you for all your energy, man, all your time, all your following, all your insight. We appreciate you. We appreciate you from the heart. So, Madison, what are we going to talk about? Because I, I don't know. know. Start. Um, don't know we want to talk about either. the weather, May? Yeah. Yeah, it's too cold. It's too cold. It's too cold for May. And we are being cute. No, it's like really cold. Like, I'm over here. It's about to be June, and uh, it's not working. All right. Let's talk about spirituality. I think that's a great topic. Yeah. We can go there. We can definitely start there. <laughs> <laughs> And how it relates to art. Mm -hmm. So oh. you and an artist, and you have so many hats, I can't stop. So you just tell me about all those hats or the ones that you want to talk about. Okay, well, you know, season two of the podcast is coming out. There you go. Yes. Go, 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 go. Season two is coming out very soon, guys. We are not releasing a date because we want to surprise you all. But uh, season two is coming out. My first interview was Swiss Beats. Uh, amazing, amazing man, talent, information that he's giving. Uh what else am I doing right now? I'm digital producing for uh, IHOP and McDonald's. They're both my clients. Uh, Chemo Bentley Cosmetics. I'm digital producer for that. I also represent the city of Jersey City, New Jersey. I'm reconstructing youth development programs there. Uh, just got off of an international tour, uh, the Create Your Destiny tour. Uh, we started in Canada. I taught at Columbia University. It was amazing. The whole tour. We stopped uh, Washington, Canada, Chicago. Uh, in New York, of course, where I taught at Columbia. Uh, what else? All hell, all hell the queen. <laughs> all hell the new queen of media. Y'all see? So, yeah, that's not even the... And your website. Where can they find oh, you on your website? MadisonJ.com. We, uh, it's international now. We just signed um, a few new editors and chiefs. We have one in Toronto. You know, we have the South Africa division. We have the, the, the UK division. Uh, we just signed someone in Scotland. Uh, we have bloggers from all over the United States, from Indiana, Washington, Connecticut, New York, Los Angeles, Texas, you name it, and we have them. Good. So now, how did your spirituality mm -hmm. push you into your work? Because a lot of people, they have ideas, and um, they, they're stuck. Yeah. They know they're artists, they know how they have creative things and insights, but... How, how did that begin for you? You know, the spirituality part, you know, not necessarily religion or maybe religion, but, okay. but how did that come where you were able to say, this is what I need to do when you started? Um, and I know that could be a long story, but yeah, that's, a that's short version. I'm going to keep it real. I'm going to keep it cute. Uh, well, it started, spirituality is actually a huge section on my website. It's actually the first, um, the one I like to nurture the most. But I think spirituality, and I like the fact that you said not religion, but spirituality, yes. it's embedded in us, uh, into our DNAs, because we are we are spiritual Papa. beings living a human experience, guys. Did you get that from James Paul? I got that from Oprah. Oh, Professor yeah. James Paul says that too. She did? I mean, no, he, he did. Does, Excuse yes. me. Yeah, I got it from Oprah when I did when I covered the life. I of think one she store. got it from Professor. She might have got it from him. So now I know I'm the source. A, well, I'm it's give, one of them. One of them started I'm gonna it. Give, I'm going to give Professor James <laughs> Paul his props. But yeah, she. Yeah. Um, well, I got it from Oprah. Uh, we are spiritual beings. Like we feel, we have a void to fill, a purpose. We all are sent here. Oh, just to come do closer. Something. You got to tell him. Be big. For wait, them. but you know what the you thing know, is? No. I'm, I'm already so oh, short. No, I want you to so they can hear. They no. need to see your face and your features. But um, we are like Oprah and what's that? <laughs> Professor James Moore. Yeah, we're um, we're human beings. We're spiritual beings living a human experience. This life is very temporary. We're all seen here in order to change the world for the better good. And if you look back, you can always connect the dots looking back, not forward. So if you look back and the things that you've done and experienced, they're all connected so that you can serve.